Hello, ladies and gentlemen. New studies have shown that directly giving money to the poor are one of the best ways to help them. What's next? Will they find that regular breathing is essential to life? One businessman took to the internet to question if people should fly in shorts instead of pants. I find it's better to fly in airplanes instead of clothing. Last week, New York sets a new milestone, going another week without any murders. Surely they'll make up for it in the weeks to come. I'm Hal Roof Mustang Update, and this is your News of the Week. The U.S. Postal Service will be destroying sets of stamps that depict children performing unsafe activities, while the public is still surprised that people buy stamps. Mark Zuckerberg just spent over $30 million buying four homes next to his own for some more privacy. Doesn't matter though, because the NSA will soon dispatch a drone over his house. A father frustrated with his son's constant World of Warcraft gameplay hired a team of assassins to kill his in-game character. Of course, he forgot to account for respawns. I'm Howard with Mustang Update, and this has been your News of the Week. My name is Chase with your Scooter's News. I'm flying, Jack! I'm flying! All students taking the PSAT this Saturday. It's between 7.40 to 12. Don't forget your ID cards. Homecoming assembly is on Thursday next week. Homecoming game is next Friday at 7 p.m. Don't forget to come. Also, the following day is homecoming dance. Um, don't forget to buy your tickets. Hi, I'm Zoe from Mustang Update, and we're here with... Dr. Buddy Clements. I've heard there's a concert coming up. Yes, it's Thursday, October 24th in the Wallen High School Performing Arts Center at 7 o'clock, and it's our annual Autumn Serenade concert, which features our two large string orchestras and uh, our symphony orchestra. as well as our special guest, the Suzanne uh, String Orchestra, and we'll be uh, performing a variety of selections, mostly classical sort of oriented, uh, and we'll be featuring two student uh, concerto uh, competition winners, and that is uh, Phyllis Pan will be doing um, 
one of the Tchaik or the Tchaikovsky Piano Concerto, and uh, Ricky Worth will be playing a beautiful uh, cello concerto uh, by Edward Elgar. Uh, you can purchase tickets uh, either that night at the box office or uh, the best place always is online at www.seatyourself.biz slash walnut music. Don't forget to buy your tickets. As the narrator, I have to in interact a lot with the audience and I had to make sure that they're always pumped up and they always have a positive attitude because usually actors work a lot off of how the audience reacts to them. So keeping the audience in a good mood with positive attitudes helps the actors. We have been practicing re slash rehearsing for this show since week two of school. My character name is Pantalone, and I am an old, old man who thinks he's dying, but he's not actually dying, he's actually just hung over from the day before because he got an elixir of youth from a doctor. So, my character basically thinks he's dying this whole time, so he arranges a meeting between my other good friend, who's also a very old guy, and we kind of plan a marriage between my son and his daughter, and it gets crazy from that point. So we're kind of the, we move the story along. My character is a young lady that just left a convent, and my mistress is trying to marry me off so she can get money. It's actually really important to me because this is my first fall production, and this is probably, it's my last fall production because I'm a senior, and this is the first spe like major speaking role I've had. So my character is Flavio. He's basically the hippie of the play, and probably one of the lovers, and he just goes around and starts singing by the lute. And for all those who don't know what a lute is, it's like a guitar. Um, my character is Antonia, and I'm a servant to Pantalone de Besignosi. People should see this show because it's really funny, and you're going to enjoy it because it just has a good storyline. People should see this show because it is drop dead funny. It's really funny, like physically funny, and it's theater in the round, and that's completely unheard of. So I think it's going to be a once in a lifetime opportunity to see it at Walnut High School. The shows are the 16th through the 19th at 7 o'clock, and there's a matinee at 2 o'clock on Saturday. Ticket prices are $10 if you buy them at lunch or online, and if you buy them at the door, they are $12. <laughs> I have a sad story to tell you It may hurt your feelings a bit Last night when I walked into my bathroom I stepped in a big pile of shaving cream Be nice and clean Shave every day and you'll always look keen I think I'll break off with my girlfriend Her antics are queer, I'll admit Each time I say, darling, I love you She tells me that I'm full of shaving cream Be nice and clean Shave every day and you'll always look keen Our baby fell out of the window you think that her head would be split But good luck was with her that morning She fell in a barrel of shaving cream Be nice and clean Shave every day and you'll always look keen And now folks, my story is ended I think it is time I should quit if any of you feel offended, stick your head in a barrel of shaving cream. Be nice and clean, shave every day and you'll always look keen.